Meep Geese and Mary Steen Virgin. Good morning. Good morning. Tell me first, Meep, how it was that you came to Hyde and and her family and the other family that, that was there with them as well. Mr. Frank asked me once a day, please, uh, Meep, I uh, have a cigarette. I want to ask you, oh, we will go in hiding. Are you uh, ready to help us? And I said yes. Did you yeah. hesitate at all? Did you, did you, did you worry about yourself at all when he? No, no, no. I was not worried about me. Mm -hmm. That was necessary. My advice is always help people who need help, and so yeah, I did. Uh, what is it like for you to play Meep and to have met Meep? before that actual filming? Well, first of all, she's a wonderful woman who, who um, she doesn't, she's uncomfortable with, all, I think, all the limelight that suddenly came her way. I, um, I, I think that she wrote her book, and Frank remembered, only after 40 years after it all happened, because people made her feel that as one of the last, if not the last component of the story, she owed it to history to write the book. But she's not someone who uh, seeks out glory or limelight. And I think that it's all been strange and for her, this, this whole thing, because she's very modest about her own heroism. Mm. And um, I tried to play the part in a way that hopefully will make her happy in that it's not an obvious heroine with you know the he head held high against the wind, but somebody who was an ordinary person who something extraordinary happened to them, and she had a choice. She could either be brave and follow her heart, or she could walk away from it, and she chose to follow her heart. You you shot the film in Amsterdam. You shot it on the on the streets where all of this took place. What was that like? Well, it was extraordinary because um, the people of Amsterdam remember that, that time very clearly. And it, I think it seems like yesterday to an awful lot of them. And there were always people crowded around standing watching the shooting. Um, the production qualities of this um, show were really extraordinary so that whatever you were looking at looked very real. It was like stepping back into time. And I think it was very emotional. There was, on any given day, there was someone standing there, particularly the older men and women with tears rolling down their faces. And um, there's still, on their part, you know, a great memory and to some degree a great anger about this time. Did you, you thought Anne would come back and get her diary? Yes. After hours, I don't know how long, came Ellie back, my husband, and then we go upstairs in the hiding because I had a key, a double key. And that was a terrible, a terrible sight what we saw there. All the papers on the ground, all the chairs on the ground, all the, the, the custard, all the cupboards were open. It was, it was a chaos. And we are looking, Ellie, me, my husband, and then we saw the diary from Anne Frank. Mary Steen Virgin, Meep Geese, thank you both for joining us this morning. We'll be back.